Hey, what's up guys? So in this video, we will see how to enable Dynamic Island on any Hyper OS phone. Now to do that, just open the Play Store. Now from here, just search Dynamic Island. Now from here, just download the Dynamic Spot app. Now, as you can see, I have already installed this app on my smartphone. If you have not installed it yet, just tap on install. And once the app is fully downloaded, tap on open. Now from here, tap on next. Now from here, tap on select apps. Now from here, tap on all. Now from here, go back and tap on notification access. Now from here, scroll down and tap on dynamic spot. Now from here, just enable allow notification access. Now from here, just select I am aware of the possible risks. Now from here, just wait a few seconds, then tap on OK. Now from here, just tap on draw on screen. Now from here, select no restrictions. Now from here, just tap on draw on screen and tap on next. Now from here, tap on downloaded apps. Now from here, just tap on dynamic spot. Now from here, just enable use dynamic spot. Now from here, just select I am aware of the possible risks. Now from here, just wait a few seconds, then tap on OK. Now from here, just tap on done. Now from here, just tap on this X icon at the upper right corner on the display. Now from here, if we tap on this play button, we can see the preview of the dynamic island. Just tap on allow. Now, as you can see, this is the preview of the dynamic island. Now from here, if you tap on position, you can change the position of the dynamic island. Now from here, if you tap on appearance, you can change the appearance of the dynamic island. Now, as you can see, our smartphone has a notch. So I will select this option and it will change the dynamic island into a notch format. Now from here, just go back and tap on position. Now from here, you can change the position of the dynamic island from center to left. We will select center. Now from here, now from here, you can change the horizontal position of the dynamic island. Just like that. And also you can change the vertical position of the dynamic island. Now from here, you can increase or decrease the horizontal size of the dynamic island. Just like that. And also you can change the vertical position of the dynamic island. Just like that. Now from here, just go to your home screen. Now from here, let's open the music app. Now from here, let's play a music. Now from here, if you go to your home screen, as you can see in the dynamic island, it is showing that the music is playing in the background. Just like that. Now, if you tap on the dynamic island, you can play or pause the music, or you can change the music by tapping forward. You can change the music by tapping on back. And this is how you can enable dynamic island on any Hyper OS phone. If you found this video helpful, please like the video and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to get notified when we upload a new video.